Hi, so today I have my SJ Cam uh, SJ5000X and I'm going to be doing a firmware update. Um, a few people have commented and wanted like a step by step, so that's what we're going to do today. Um, and I just also want to show you guys how to see what firmware you're running. So we're going to go into our camera and we're going to click this mode button and we're going to go all the way into the settings and then we're going to go into the setup okay so this is the only way I can get it to show on the screen but we're going to go down until we reach This version at the very last one and mine says I'm running V 1.2.5 S and um, this past month SJ cam has released a 1.3 so that's what we're going to be installing today okay so the first thing we're going to need is a micro SD card uh, you're going to need to format this I will show you how to do it on a Apple computer and if you have a Windows I think it's fairly simple you can um, look it up or I'll put instructions at the bottom of this video so let's first um, put this into our computer I have a SD card reader um, so let's do that okay so the first thing we want to do is format our memory card um, we're gonna do that by clicking the finder and then we're going to click applications and then we're going to go into our utilities and then we are going to go into our disk utility and then here we see my hard drive and then here is the SD card so I'm going to click this volume one I'm going to click erase I'm going to click erase I'm going to click erase and then now this is formatting our card so that there isn't any um, excess files on it that might disrupt our firmware update. So let's close out of here. What we want to do is we want to open our browser and we're going to go to sjcamhd.com. There are actually two SJCAM websites. Um, this is the official one, so do not download any firmware from any other one websites. Uh, we wanna go ahead and we wanna drag our cursor over this firmware, and then we want to click this SJ5000 series because we are essentially upgrading the 5000X. So now we are going to click this SJ5000X and then here we can see what it is that they've done on the firmware update and we're going to click this um, V1.3 this is the older one 1.25 so I downloaded it already but I'm just going to download it again I have not run the update yet so we'll do that together so when it is done downloading it's going to be in your downloads folder. Uh, this is if you have a Mac set up the way that I do. Um, and this actually recorded as a .rar, which I don't really like. I prefer when it's .zip. Uh, it's easier to extract, but um, you know, this is what it is. So to extract a .rar file, I've downloaded this program called RAR Extractor Free. Um, this is my preferences with it. So I'm going to go into my file and I'm going to do open and I'm going to do my downloads because this is where it was. And then I'm going to click my um, 5000X 1.3 and then I'm going to click open. And now we can see that this has created a file here. So what we're going to do is we're going to just close all these out. We're going to open our SD card and we are going to drag this file into our card. 
So uh, we're done on the computer side, so we're just going to take our memory card out and put it into our camera. Okay, so we've done our part on the computer, so we're going to take out our memory card and we are going to insert it into our camera. We're going to turn this on. You can see it's taking much longer than it typically takes because it is updating. It's flashing on the top. All right, so it's starting up. And let us go back into our version. Oh, this is different. Way different menu we've got. And not sure if you can see properly, but it is currently running version 1.3-S. So that is how uh, you update your firmware. Um, I'm going to be doing a really quick, short video comparing this to the 5000, which I have here. Um, and that'll be the next one that I post, hopefully in the next few days. Uh, maybe even tonight if I can get around to it. Um, so as always, thanks for watching. And if you guys have any suggestions for more videos or you want to see something, uh, comment below and I will do my best to accommodate. So thank you.